بسم اللہ الرحمن الرحیم ریسپیکٹڈ فارمر اے چیفز وائس چیف آف اے سٹاف پرنسپل سٹاف آفسرز پی ایف ویٹنز مین اینڈ ویمن ان بلو لیڈیز اینڈ جنٹلمن السلام علیکم وی ہیو گیدر ٹو کمیموریٹ آر ریساؤنڈنگ وکٹری ان آپریشن سوئفٹ ریٹارٹ when Pakistan Air Force, living up to its legacy, yet again made its mark through professional excellence and valor. Indeed, we have prompt, made, and surprising response busted the aggressor's arrogance. No doubt, our success is attributed to blessings of Allah Almighty. Decades long hard work, investment in PF operational capacity by our predecessors and the heroic acts of our personnel. Let there be no doubt that PF is and would remain reassuring fundamental of national defense. Ladies and gentlemen, Pakistan has been facing diversified challenges including economic constraints, active involvement in war on terror, and difficulties in technological acquisition. Despite these, PF has continued on the path of professional consolidation over the last two decades. While we solidified our professional training, capability enhancement remained our primary pursuit through indigenization. Today, our platforms, complemented by advanced precision guided weaponry, fully illustrate successful realization of our homegrown technological pursuits. Alongside, we played special emphasis on human resource development and force multipliers in making robust architecture of Pakistan Air Force. As a result, we stand as fully integrated force that is hard-hitting and focused on its mission. I am proud that patriotic, dedicated, and competent men and women in Pakistan Air Force believe in invincible defense of the country in complete synergy with sister services. My comrades, while I assure Pakistani nation on the preparedness of PF to counter threats, we will not compromise on sovereignty or territorial integrity of Pakistan. Remember, professionally we are second to none. Alongside other services, PF remains poised to the defense of Pakistan. Our human resource has been well-tuned with all spectrum threats. More significant in last year, February, was your professional superiority and lethality. We performed as a team in that Allah provided me an opportunity to lead a team of devoted and professional comrades. We also highly value the sentiments of our veterans and Pakistani citizens for volunteering their services during testing times. Ladies and gentlemen, Pakistan Air Force is one of the most respected and responsible air forces of a peace-loving country. Prior to aggression last year, our national leadership had made it amply clear that no misadventure against Pakistan would ever go unresponded. Today, I reiterate that commitment and caution to respond to the aggressor was our compulsion, but measured and calibrated response was entirely our choice. Make no mistake, PF when response to irresponsible act, we may not always excise restraint while celebrating 
first anniversary of the Operation Swift retort, we are alive to the plight of Kashmiri brothers. Pakistan remains fully committed to their justified cause of independence and right to self-determination. We stand by the Kashmiri people at all times and will extend them moral, political, and diplomatic support. It is time that human rights violations and the longest curfew ever in the Indian occupied Kashmir must come to an end. Ladies and gentlemen, while I appreciate all the branches and personnel for their, their dedicated efforts and active role during Operation Swift Retort, I urge each one of you to channel your energies wholeheartedly for the development of the country and this elite organization, Pakistan Air Force. I will take this opportunity to also commend the positive role of Pakistani media for countering false Indian rhetoric while upholding your professional ethics and ethos. May Allah Almighty guide our efforts and give us strength to come up to the nation's expectations. Amin. Pakistan Air Force Zindabad, Pakistan Pahindabad.